because it's Neville's signature and he sent me the book. Oh, Neville himself sent you that book? Yes. Why did he do that? Because, uh... Because I, he had wanted testimonials. See this guy, Neville. And I went for just one purpose, just to find out what a fraud he is and how much money he wanted. <laughs> when he came on stage, he says, we want to get one thing perfectly clear. If you want to give money today, you're not allowed. And you are never to give me any money. How is this guy going to get around this? He's got to be some kind of fraud. He was not a fraud. He says, I'm going to teach you right now how to climb a ladder and what you must do to prove that I'm wrong is do what I'm telling you to do. And if it doesn't work out, I'm a fraud. But this is the way you climb a ladder. He says, first of all, right now, picture a ladder in front of you. Picture it. You can do it. Take your imaginary left hand. Reach out and take hold of the side of the ladder. Now with your imaginary right hand, reach out and take the other side of the ladder. Now with your imaginary left foot, lift it up and put it on the first rung. Now push yourself up and start climbing the ladder. When you get to the top of the ladder, climb back down, climb back up, Climb back down. Now, Andrew, you must do this or nothing I'm teaching you will work. You must put inside your wallet where when you open your wallet, you have to read it. You say, I will not climb a ladder. He says, now you must do all this or nothing I'm teaching you will ever mean anything to you and it'll be no good. You must do this. You must mean in your heart that you will not climb a ladder. Put it down, I won't climb a ladder everywhere. And for three nights, you have to climb the ladder until you sleep. When you wake up in the morning, you've got to write it, make sure it's something you see every day. I will not climb a ladder. He says, next Sunday, I'm going to have another meeting, just like this one, in the back of this building. But that's only for people that have climbed the ladder. If you've climbed a ladder, come to that meeting because you swore you wouldn't and you did. I thought, this guy is f***ing nuts. But I took his challenge and I climbed a ladder to sleep for three nights. My mother called me and said she wanted me to come see her on Saturday. She wanted, she had something she wanted to talk to me about. Get off the bus and I'm walking to the house. Mm -hmm. My father's on top of the roof. And he said to me, son, would you hand me that bucket of paint? I picked up the bucket of paint and I almost fainted because I'm halfway up the ladder. And I had written, I won't climb a ladder on everything. It was on the wall. It was exactly like he said. You've got to put it everywhere you look. I'm not going to climb a ladder. I'm not going to climb a ladder. Oh, God, it's written there. It's written here. And you mean it. You're going to prove that devil is a I pick up the bucket of bait, and I'm halfway up the ladder, and I thought, I climbed a f***ing ladder, just like this guy said. So I went to that meeting, and he says, now you all climbed the ladder. You could have just as easily made a million bucks in cash as you did in climbing the ladder. I'm going to teach you how to be healthy, wealthy, and wise, and you're never to give me a dime. I do this because I like to do it. And bingo, I took off. I 